the cloak and dagger. I've been training to become like you, but training isn't enough. You're more than a warrior. The blood of the gods runs through your veins. I thought they preferred Isu in Atlantis. The Isu may as well be the divine with how they rule. Cold, calculating, indifferent to the people milling beneath them. But it's not just Isu blood that makes you special, is it? There's something else. Well, you tell me. I'm talking about this. Your spear. Oh, showing off for me, are you? Just a little. Are you impressed? You're strangely charming. For a thief. Flattering. But we have business to attend to, the Castis. So, what do you want from me? I'm involved with Atlas. He's afraid of taking the relationship public. He says his enemies would exploit me as his weakness, so he keeps me a secret. Wait, you're in love with Atlas? From my experience, I'm not sure Isu men truly love. Nevertheless, I need to make him see that I can be his strength. Our partnership might be a key to bridging the gap between Isu and humans. Your love is strategic. If we take the relationship public, we could marry and I could rule the district by his side, influence policy and ease the tension between the two groups. But so long as I am merely human, it can never be. That's why I want to be like you. You seem very passionate about Atlantean politics. Atlas doesn't approach the human and Isu conflict with compassion for humanity. I believe I can bring that compassion. Someone so ready to kill his own brothers hardly strikes me as husband material. Atlas is like any Isu, aloof and unchanging. That's why we make a good team. I bring out his humanity. It would be nice to have another ally in Atlantis. What's your plan? At the Adamant Metalon, they harvest a metal used to create devices just like your spear. My spear's the strongest metal ever forged. Could this be used to forge other weapons? Well, Adamant ingots could. But what I need is raw Adamant. I know the one who can forge it for me. The Atlas can't suspect what I'm up to, so make sure you're not seen. He doesn't know about this? I'll tell him the truth when the time is right. Please, hurry back. Please, Alexios, bring me the raw adamant when you can. Looks like this might be where they store the raw adamant after mining it. somehow. Almost like they were meant to be together. Raw Adamant, as promised. Nice to see that you're as skilled as you look. I'm making the right choice to become more like you. You seem fine to me. I don't know why you're trying to change. Just as you were destined to be the Castiz, I am destined for this. I just know it. Atlantis isn't worthy of the type of change you're hoping to bring if they can't accept you as you are. Like most great politicians, I'm ahead of my time. That means I need to do something drastic if I'm going to push Atlantis forward for humans. Still, all you have is raw adamant. 
Until I take it to a skilled blacksmith so he can forge an Isu device from the adamant. Well, you know where to find the Dicastis when you need him. The forging takes time. What we do next will change Atlantis irreversibly. You should make sure you complete all your duties as Dicastis before meeting me at the Loma of Atlas. Heavy. And here's a note. The Forge of Atlantis. This can be used to create weapons. I have to find this place. Want to tell me what that was all about? No. I'll be fine. The Castis! You can make this all go away! My name is Lyra, and you're... You! You've helped so many people. You're amazing and wonderful and powerful and... And you're here! <laughs> Thank you. That's nice of you. You deserve all the praise and more. They called you a murderer. You don't seem the type, but as the Castis, I have to be sure. They're sure I'm responsible for what happened to that poor family. They said it's like the other murders, but I couldn't leave with myself, I swear. Please, please clear my name. Where were you when the family was murdered? If it happened last night like they said, I was here trying to sleep. Although, lately it's been restless, filled with strange dreams. It's always the same one, over and over. Were you alone? Well, yes. I've been so tired lately, I decided to stay in. You said something about other murders. This was the... third time. I just don't understand why they blame me. I, I don't have the stomach to do that. I'll find out what really happened. Just point me in the direction of the attack. Just down the road. Not too far from here. If I were you, I'd hide until I return. Ah, oh, good idea. Thank you. You truly are a great de Castis. <laughs> Maybe someone around here saw what happened last night. These footprints track the blood out of the house. Whoever murdered them left this way. These aren't stab wounds. They're claw marks. This bloody cloth doesn't match the mother or daughter's robes. It must have come off the murderer. Is this about what happened last night? How do you know? It's all everyone's talking about. And if the Tijastis is here, you must be looking into it. If you saw or heard anything, I need to know. I saw it from the distance. Heard it too. Its howl will never leave my mind. You saw a wolf? Beast is more like it. If you see it, run! I'll be careful. <laughs> ah, the great Ligastis. What did I do to deserve a visit? I'm looking into the attack that happened nearby last night. Ah, of course. I thought that was meant to be handled already. You mean the mob harassing that woman? I I've said enough. I understand your hesitation, but I'm trying to get to the bottom of this. I'll make sure whoever or whatever did this is punished. You've already met the guilty one. Lyra? You agree with the mob? Of course I do. I'm the one who told them it was her. I saw her last night, bloody and in a frenzy. It was dark. How do you know it was her? I know what I saw. 
I should return to Lyra and let her know what I found. <laughs> <laughs>